everyone, my name's Harriet Diller. I'm a painter and a printmaker, and seeing as I don't have a printing press where I am spending lovely lockdown, I'm gonna try and make some dry points today using my car as a printing press. So I usually make my prints um, using Tetra Pak, and you can use anything like, I use Innocent Smoothie packets, but anything that has this like metal -y inside. Well, to get the dry point down, you just basically use a pointed tool to etch into it. So you can just draw into the te Tetra Pak with the sharp tool and it creates a line and then the, the ink will be caught up in that and it will make a print. So I'm just uh, mixing up some ink. You can use, a, I've got some printing ink, but you can basically use any water soluble ink. Yeah, I'm just gonna mix up a kind of purpley color. And then once I've got color I want. I'm just going to start to get it into the grooves. I think you've got to get quite a lot of paint in there, although I haven't been so successful to date. But just covering that all in. Then I'm going to get some scrim um, and just use that to in circular motions, I'm just trying to really get the uh, ink into the surface. Yeah, I want to get the uh, the edges nice so that you can really see the. It makes it go really nice and three dimensional. Okay, so I have been soaking some paper in this water for about ten minutes, and I've created this little blotting station just with some printer paper that's all I really had and uh, I'm just gonna get that out the water just shake it off a bit and blot it between these sheets and then I'm going to lay it onto my print. It's still quite wet. I'm finding that that actually works better for these because the ink picks it up, picks up better. And then I'm going to put another layer on top and then put this all under the wheel of my car. And then I'm going to drive over it. So let's have a look. Hmm. So that one didn't really turn out that well. Okay, so the last one didn't work, so I've done another one. And, well, that's kind of worked. Uh, you can see the marks through, so I think I'm, ah, I'm going to try and do another one uh, with lots more ink and wet the ink when I put it down. That's clearly the key. So these are a selection of probably the best ones that I've made today. Each uh, Tetra Pak probably only makes about five or six prints. All of these I just varied um, how much ink I put on how much water I used, basically just trying out different ways. And yeah, you can kind of see the uh, people walking their dog on a beach scene, which it was based on. You can get some really interesting, uh, unexpected techniques with this process. So if you've got a car, give it a go.